Once, we were part of Great Caesar's tribe, but then soldiers came. Many apes died, and we fled. Led by father, we crossed rivers and mountains, walked for many moons, until we found this mountain, this home, our century. Somewhere we could live in peace. But now winter is coming. And there is no more food here. Apes are starving. We must find food somewhere soon. <laughs> yes, brother. Think before you speak. Tom Ross, he was a good leader of this town, a fair leader. <laughs> Some of us didn't always agree with him, but when things got bad, he led us all. Now his wife, Jess, has agreed to carry his work on. Let us hope God is with her and us. Laid low by illness, but a fighter till the end. 
Rest easy, friend. Tom wasn't a religious man, but he would have appreciated that. <laughs> Difficult days ahead. For you, and for all of us. Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Maria. Jess. This loss. It's not just yours. No. I know. People like Tom. He was a strong leader. It's what Millerton needed. It's what this town needs now. Winter is coming. Someone's gonna have to make some tough decisions. You really think that's you? Are you saying that's you? Well, the people here, they, they know me, Jess. They trust me. Do you really know what we got in store for winter? Whether we're prepared or not? Sure. I know we have to work together. The hard days ahead, Jess. I get it. Cold, snow, food in short supply. Mark. Please stop. You're giving me orders? Now you're in charge? That's not fair. I miss your dad, too. Hey, you're the new leader now! So go lead! My sons, Tola, Bryn, Juno, the first snow has fallen. The tribe is hungry, scared. We must show them we are strong. Tola, you will lead the hunt tonight and take Bryn. And Juno. Tribe see brothers strong together. Yes, father. I will follow Tola.
We have guns, like humans. We can kill too. Enough! You will do as I say. Hunt together. Bring food for tribe. A dead ape staff? Juno is no good for this. What is Juno good for? My sons will hunt together. Yes, you can see, huh? It's not enough. You're right, it's not. It's a big problem. What about the flour? Uh, Tom said there were cases of powdered milk, other stuff. I guess Tom didn't want to worry you. Question is, what are you gonna do? What do you think? No easy answers. And are you gonna tell people what the hell we're facing? No. We keep this quiet for now. Yeah, I agree. People here have gone through a lot, Jess. You're their leader. Better watch how you lead. Jess, come take a look. Riders, two up. Doesn't look good. You in a hurry to start a fight? We don't know a damn thing about these two, Jess. Don't think they're gonna like having a rifle aimed at them. That's close enough! Well, I guess you can see my friend here is hurt bad. And who do I have the pleasure of addressing? Jess Ross! I'm in charge here! And you are? Well, I'm Jacob Willett. And my wounded friend here, that's Oswald Reeves. Yeah, hunting accident. Kinda hurts. <coughs> what did you have in mind, Mr. Willits? Well, I'd like to tend to my friend's wounds. Get a roof over our heads a few nights, some water feed for our horses. 
Maybe you do some work for you in exchange? What are you doing out here? We're just drifters, Miss Ross, trying to stay alive. We don't get many strangers. What the hell brought you to Millerton? Uh, things got bad out there, you know? Hunger, disease, and dying. There's a lot of scared people. People who want what somebody else has. And we're a lot better off. <clears throat> on our own. You alright? Yeah. I think so. What do you say, Jess? I don't like the looks of these guys. And we haven't got food to spare. Wait a minute. That man's hurt. And you want us to turn our backs on them. I don't want to take the risk. They look like trouble. Come on, Jess. Get them in. Now. I can't let you in! Jess! I can't take any chances. Don't leave a man to bleed out in the dirt. I won't let you do it! Yes, Clarence. I know. I will do my best.
Tonight, we hunt on the plains. Tonight, we bring food for the tribe! Humans! Oh. Humans! Oh. Humans here!
humans. Humans will see us. Humans bad. Humans bad. Father said. Father said. Father said! Mikey, someone's out there. Now, human no ape here! Tribe in danger! This is your fault, Tolo! Yours are still human food! Strong hunters. We find much food for tribe. Good steer. Oh. Mm.
Mikey! Mikey, what the hell happened? My shoulder... Took a shot. Where's Pete? Who did this? Oh god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. You're gonna be fine. Rainy. The herd, what if we lost it? Jess, I need to get him inside. Hang on, Maria. We gotta find out what's happened. Mark, medical kit. Now. <laughs> Just tell us what happened, son. Me and Pete, we were with the herd by the creek. Some, something spooked him. This thing took Pete. Y'all are gonna think I'm crazy, but it was an ape. What? You say you saw an ape? Yeah, no, I mean, uh, more than one, apes. <laughs> Mikey, Mikey. <laughs> what about the herd? What about Pete? I told you. A goddamn ape killed Pete. Apes, apes, man. Take it easy. Calm down. Mark, pressure on. Yes, we gotta get out there, find Pete, and check on the cattle. In the dark? Are you crazy, Rainy? <laughs> No, you're right. We gotta find Pete and we gotta find the steer. I need to get this bullet out now. I need some help. Give the doc a hand. All right, folks, get back to bed. There's nothing more to see. Jess, I gotta show you something. Willits and Reeves saddlebags, I checked them. You're not gonna believe what I found. I don't think you've been entirely honest with us. Because you sure as hell ain't who you say you are. I guess it's time we came clean, eh, Oswald? Fact is, we didn't want to scare you guys unnecessarily. But we're, uh, what you'd call ape hunters. <laughs> You're what? We hunt apes since the flu. Somehow they got out. They got smart. Bred like rats. Use guns. Guns? Yup. Shoot you real dead, too. Wow. Your wounds mighty improved. Oh, yeah. How about that? I guess I'm one of those lucky types. Heals fast. <laughs> Apes, they are a scourge. They've been heading east. We've been tracking them. See, what we do is we find a tribe and we rob them out. And people are usually pretty grateful. Surprisingly grateful. So you knew about these apes. Now, what else didn't you tell us? I wouldn't say we knew you had an ape problem. Fact is, we thought you folks might be fine out here. I guess now we've changed our minds about that. You know what, Willits? I don't give a damn about the apes moving east. We got a herd to protect, and we can't afford to lose any more cattle or any more men. Yeah, I appreciate that vote of confidence, but the thing is, we don't know how bad your ape problem is. Could be a whole army of them out there. And I'm guessing you folks don't have a damn clue what you're gonna face. So for us, come morning, we're turning south. Yeah, you're right. We don't have a clue. But maybe you do, so why don't you share what you know, huh? Yeah, maybe next time. If there is a next time. Your town, none too friendly either. I think you can sort this out. All right, I get it. Couple of punk drifters, all talk. Come on, Jess, let's get out of here. 
Ma'am, Mr. Rainey, you really want our help, you know what, we'll help. But here's the thing, you need to listen to us and do exactly what we say, when we say it, or more people are gonna die. It's your call, Jess. Yeah, we'll listen. But let's get one thing straight. You don't call the shots, I do. Okay, we'll help you. Not right now. We're gonna get some sleep. <clears throat> but come tomorrow, though, we'll track us some apes. Hell, maybe even kill a few. <laughs> Y'all shut the door, we're getting a little bit of a draft in here. Tribe! Oh, oh. Tell him we found steel on the mountain. On stone.
Yes. Did you see humans? Yes. There were two. Did you hurt them? We had to kill one. The other... Escaped. Oh, my sons are fools. You put the tribe in danger! Now, Mark, you wait here. Neck broken like a twig. 
a hell of a way to go. Y'all see these tracks? Bunch of apes. Five, six, maybe. Chimps, mostly. But you see here? At least one gorilla. And they're riding horses, too. You think they're still close? Yeah. What the hell happened here? My guess is that's where that gorilla crashed through. The other five or six through this one. With guns. Say it wasn't a fair fight. Well, maybe it was just a random attack. And they moved on. Yeah, I mean, why would they stay? Look, winter's coming. Just like us, they need food. My guess is they're close. What if they're watching us right now? Maybe they are. Apes get a taste of blood, it's no telling what they do. There's only one way to find out. Like, they like trees. Yeah, they like cover. Yeah, it's easy enough to track them from here. So we hunt them down? Now, hold on. Now, we came here for Pete and the herd. There is no way in hell that we're going after them. Right. We get the herd safe, take Pete's body and ride back into town. Okay, look, you guys gotta listen. All right, you need to know what you're up against. How many of them are there? Hey, are they moving on or are they here to stay? Damn it. All right. Blake, we need to get Pete back to town. The herd to safety. Take care of it. Yeah. Mark, I want you to stay close. Of course. Hey, Mark. Why don't you give Blake a hand, huh? Get Pete laid to rest. Bring this deer in. It's an important job, son. Okay, let's go find some apes. Good man. close. Y'all better be ready. Willett, what do you know about these apes? No. I know they're Ripian too. I'll tell you this though. They go down with a headshot. Anything else, you better empty that clip. So 
So what you're saying is we have to kill them? Yeah, it's a... a kill or be killed type of situation. You wanna know what to do if one of them grabs you? Let me guess, Reeves. Kiss your ass goodbye. <laughs> Something like that. Cactus. And they ran off. We beat them. Yeah, maybe. We should get the hell out of here. Camp is close. We can still. Clarence, take 
What the hell happened? We found the apes all right. Tracked them straight into an ambush. Where's Isaac? I I'm sorry. Isaac didn't make it. Two dead in 24 hours. God, Jess. I know, and they're still out there. But for now, we have to take care of everyone here. Jess! We gotta start protecting ourselves, and fast. Get people looking for waves that apes can break into this town. Okay. I'll get people to help, but we have to take precautions. All right. Jess, you gotta get this town safe again. Now, it could be Oswald and I help you with that. I thought you might have ideas. Let's hear him. Look, when the apes find you, and they will find you, they're gonna come after you. So unless you got guns on all these walls, and I do mean all these walls, then it's just a matter of time before they're in here. Okay, but hang on. We can't just hole up in here, waiting. We need to send out patrols. <laughs> Willits is right. We have to keep Millerton safe. Guns on walls. God damn it, Jess. What about our food? We got corn and beets out there to be harvested. My cattle. All out there. We're just sitting in here waiting. Securing Millerton's a priority. We take care of our people. It's a good decision, Jess. You two thinking you'll stay? You got some good people in this town. Hate to see things go wrong. Yeah, I think we will stay. Sure. In the meantime, we'll go outside and check out ways the apes could maybe get in here. What can I do?
You did this. No. <laughs> 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 Tola, ape, not fight, ape. Josh! Rainy, what the hell? Face it, Jess. We've been firing pea shooters at those damn apes. Some of them had goddamn assault rifles, for Christ's sake. Hang on. Nobody issues these weapons unless I say. Really? You don't think we need real firepower when we go back into that forest? We're not going anywhere. Not for now. This is war, Jess! We don't have a damn choice here. It's kill them, or they are gonna kill us. No. We do have a choice. No one wants more bloodshed. So, we just sit back and we wait for them. That your plan? The apes attacked us because we attacked them. Can't you see that? I'll make the calls, Rainy. You just make sure you and your men are on board.
Here. At least carry a decent weapon. All right. For defense. All right, it's your call, but just God. If you're wrong, and they come for us. If I'm wrong, then we'll fight them off. And then we'll follow them back into the forest. Find their camp. And then we'll hunt them down like rats. is dead! Tola is leader now! Oh.
I just don't get it, Mom. You should have Willis and Reeves organizing things. They've done this before. They know how to kill apes. We're lucky they showed up. They talk a good story, Mark. But the fact is, the apes are still out there. And they can hit us at any time. Sooner or later, we're gonna have to kill them, not the ape hunters. Well, they're still here. Counts for something, I guess. Well, you think Rainy would do a better job? Make better decisions than me, is that it? I'm just saying. Look. Before he got sick, Dad used to make the tough calls around here. And the town always followed him. Maybe people don't know if you can make those kind of decisions. Like with these apes. If it turns into... war... What are you gonna do? It's not gonna be a war. Maybe you just gotta think, you know? What would Dad do? A 
Listen, Mark. I'm trying my best. Please believe that. Mom? Mark, take over. What's going on? I need to get down to the generator. You stay up here. I'm coming too. Here, take this. But you stay up here. No way, you need a gun. I'm coming. I'm telling you to stay up here. Keep ringing the alarm. If anything happens, you have a gun. Mark, I love you. Get the generator working. What the hell? The crops! We need to get this up and running now. Me. 
baby. Bryn, you did not fight hard enough. Kill enough. Juno. Huh? Clarence. Juno hides. Juno. Look at me. Where is he? My fault. I should not have left you. Tola! Oh, no. We must go back and find him and have more ape die for that old fool. No! No! Hey! You need to see this. What the hell? We brought you something. Just need to ask this little fella some questions. 
What do you mean, it can talk? Only one way to find out. Look, I'm guessing you know numbers. How about you give us one? How many apes are there? Well, it's... Whatever you're doing, it's not working. Jess, here's the thing. See Oswald's face? Ape attack. Reeves was able to get away, but his daughter? Yeah, his daughter wasn't so lucky. Tore my little girl apart. Seven years old, she was. Mm. Spitting image of a mom. And it was all my fault. You see, we had an ape prisoner. <laughs> we were too damn soft on it. <laughs> Just that ape knew that other apes were coming, but wasn't talking. It seems to me we're in a similar situation right now. We need information. So what's it gonna be? Come on, Jess. Enough. It can't talk. <laughs> Maria's right. If this ape knows anything, it's not talking. You've got to stop this. It's wrong, and it's getting us nowhere. Four dead tonight, Jess. And you can't spill a damn drop of ape blood. Well, it's Reeves, that's enough. You're going to kill him. And what good will that do? Stop! Today, Ape died at human hands. But we got into their town, killed humans blood for blood. Human will seek revenge. Want to kill Ape? Hunt us down. Tell us all. But this human mistake, because when they come, we will be ready! Oh, 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 oh. Obey Brutus, and victory will be ours! Oh, oh, oh.
humans! That should be you. So what the hell are we gonna do? I sure ain't sitting around waiting for the apes to come back. There's only one thing to do. We go after them, right? Out there hunting for them, who knows what we'll face. I say we stay here. We're safer behind these walls. Come on, Jess, really? After what happened last night? Oh yeah? This how things get decided now? Come in, nothing's been decided yet. So, let's say we do go after these apes. We know there's at least a half dozen of them. It means we need a lot of guns, we're gonna get the job done. And we kill everything we find. Exactly. Did I miss something? We don't know how many of them there are. Back in the Marines, we'd take our time. Figure out what we're dealing with. <laughs> oh yeah? Well, I'm sure back in the Marines, you never went up against an army of apes. Huh? I don't think so. We go in fast, and we get them all. She's right. We don't know what's out there. Let's take a vote. Who says we do a recon first? Majority rules. <laughs> Get your people together, Rainy. Good shots. People with guts, because it ain't gonna be pretty out there. Okay, we leave at dawn. Let's get all set. There aren't gonna be any of us getting much sleep tonight. I'm going too. No, you're not. This is my town as well. I'm going. We sure could use a dock up there. People in here need me too. I'll be here when you get back. Jess, I have something to show you. Now. This is Jess. He understood what you said. Can he speak? He speaks a form of sign language. Rain comes. Winter comes. Apes want food. Apes need food. Apes Apes don't want killing. Apes want
Peace. Peace, Jess. He's talking about peace. If we let him go, he can tell his tribe that we want peace too. And you believe him? Think about it. If we let him go, we have a chance to avoid more bloodshed. Keep him. They'll just come back. It's war. I don't know. Jess. <sighs> hey, Mom, we're almost ready. I got your... Thanks. What's going on? Nothing. We're just checking in on the ape. Saddling up. We gotta go. Okay, I'll be right there. If the ape stays here, they'll kill him. You keep him safe. Keep moving. Fresh tracks. Be alert. Yeah. Well, it's an ape camp, all right. There's our way in. The old silver mines. We going in? No. We circle around. Take till nightfall to circle around. You want to be up here in dark? No, we circle around. Find another way in. Too long, Jess. They're my people, my decision. Kay, mm -hmm. stay with the horses. Mark with us. Got it. Okay, hot shot. You want to take point, head on into the cave, go right ahead. We're going to wait right here. No. We go in, you go with us. All right. We'll watch your back. Good.
down! Back to the horses! Move! 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 It's not good. Well, it's... You didn't see this coming, so what the hell do we do now? You really want to talk about how we got here? We're going to talk about how we get the hell out, because not that way. They're waiting for us. Al, I'm going to have to snap it off. Ready? On three. All right. One. Good man. Okay, let's see if we can get you to stand. Give me your hand. Mark, you good? Yeah. Rainy, it seems pretty quiet out there. Maybe only chance to make a run for it. Yeah, maybe they've gone. Yeah. You try and make a run for the horses. Mom, I used to come up here with Dad. There's another way out. This is already bad enough. That's exactly where they want you to go. Mark, you lead the way.
This is where we should go! to talk. We have to talk. I want to hear it, Rainy. Jess, please explain to me what happened. Where's Mark? Mark is still up with the apes. I wanted to stay, but I wasn't given much choice. What the hell, Rainy? I had to save Jess. There was no time for Mark. It was chaos. We walked right into an ambush. They were waiting for us. But Willits and Reeves should have known. So much for our goddamn ape hunters. No. It was my choice to go after them. It's my fault. So you're saying we're better off without them? I don't know, maybe we are. What do you think, Rainy? My gut tells me don't trust them. Never have. And what makes you think we trust you, Rainy? I don't know, he's right. I feel the same. Hey! You gotta see this. The ape. They're stringing him up! No! Don't do this! Are you kidding me? After what just happened? The last thing we need in this town is a goddamn ape! Yeah, he killed your people! Now we kill him, and y'all get to watch! Jess, are you gonna let this happen? Willits, killing this ape solves nothing! Are we all done talking here? Listen. Listen. The apes have Mark, but we have this ape. Kill him, and you've got nothing. I know you're right.
We cannot let what happened go unanswered. We'll be over soon. Tell them to stop, Jess. Yes, the ape should pay, but this ape alive could be worth something. Listen! Look, I don't know how, but maybe this ape can help me get my son back. So I'm gonna tell you one thing. We do not kill this ape now. All right, this stops now. Until we figure things out, cut him down. Bad decision, Jess. All right, folks. Looks like the show's over for now. You and I need to talk. Reeves. We've got to let this ape go free. Sooner, later, they'll kill him. The apes killed our people and took my son. Why would I let it go? Today, apes win. We beat human. Capture son of human leader. You can't kill ape. Human cannot speak. Human dumb animal. Run! Human laws. Do what you want with him. No. Humans, kill my friend, Clarence. He was wise, ape! Did you see him die? I, I don't know. A lot of apes died. Oh, oh. Clarence, special ape, not look like other apes. The orangutan. <laughs> oh, we, we, we caught him. He, he's alive. <gasps> Clarence lives! <gasps> if Clarence lives, the tribe can use this human to get him back! Yes! We must use this human to trade for Clarence! If we can trade with humans, then maybe we can have peace with humans too! Peace!
Peace! Peace! Hoaka speaks truth. Perhaps peace is possible. Peace! 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 At what cost? Oops will die! My friend, Clarence. Oh. How do you know that? Her son. He tells us. Mark's alive. No lie. Boy is alive. Oh. Safe with us. A trade. In fighting and killing peace. Peace? Is that why you're here? Metal Bridge near Mountain. First sun tomorrow. You bring Clarence. We bring Sun. Yes. Yes. I'll be there. We'll be there. If you come. Maybe bring Jess peace. Human. And you believe this ape talking deals, peace, you trust them? Yeah. Yeah, I think I do. I mean, it makes sense. 
I was open. Just a private party. <laughs> well, as you're here, I could use your opinion. All right. What's on your mind? You want to tell him? An ape came, talked to Jess. Says Mark's alive. They want to swap Mark for the ape. First light tomorrow, Miller's Bridge. Says maybe peace deals, too. You want my advice? Take it. You take that deal. <laughs> Don't tell me you trust a goddamn ape. Wait. Let's hear him out. You want your son back? You want peace? You take the deal. You take that meeting. Meanwhile, Oswald and I are thinking we could bring in some friends from outside the valley. People who know apes know how to kill apes. Think of it like insurance, backup plan for the bridge. So what are you saying? You're bringing in more people, more ape hunters. What are you talking about? I wouldn't bring them in unless you want them, but I know you need them. So it's up to you to decide if you want that help. Things do go south, Jess. No. No, I, I don't want them. I think we're better off on our own. Guess the answer's no, Willits. Seems your help. Always comes with a high price tag. It's your call. It's your son, like you said. Just trying to make sure these apes don't wipe out your nice little town here. You listen. I want my boy back. But I don't want to risk any more lives. I think Rainey's men have got this. Look, these apes aren't going to be waiting there with balloons and cake for you. You know what? It's not our problem anymore. Reeves? Good morning. Oh. Yeah, it's like I said. Think of us as backup. You want to even over there? Yeah! Well, you have a nice day now! Willits and his men. Let's hope they stay there.
Why? Clarence not move. I told you. Your friend is alive.
Mark, please help, please. Come on, baby. Come on. Mark, please come on. No, 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 no. Don't you die. You didn't waste any time getting back. Well, figured someone ought to keep an eye on a nice little town here. Just open the gate. Mark needs help now. I guess y'all just send your thank you cards later then. You seem to forget we just saved your ass. You son of a bitch. Saved us! What the hell was that back there? People are dead because of you! Our people are the only reason your people are still alive. That's how you see it, not me. Listen, get your people together and get out. You're done here. Come on, well, let's open the goddamn gates. We got wounded to tend to, dead to bury. Oh, I guess y'all didn't hear then. Yeah, we got no doctor here. Marie is not with you. Last I saw, she was under some pretty heavy fire on that bridge. Guess them problems just keep on coming, don't they?
What is this? What's going on? Things have changed, Jess. The ape threat is no longer just your problem. I think my men are here to stay. You don't get to decide that. This is my town, my people. You're upset. I can understand that, but I think with a clearer head, you'll see that my men are really the only thing between you and being wiped out. No damn way. You get your men the hell out of here, Willits. <sighs> we don't want you here. It's like I said, this is our town. You heard her, now get the hell out. Well, well, well. Now, how is that for gratitude, Oswald? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Jess, after all you've been through, I think maybe a little time out will help you reconsider your position, your options. Are you happy now? I am. Thank you for asking, Rainy. Well, I guess it's quarantine for you two. Well, you know the way. You too, sweetheart. Stand up. Paula makes mistakes. You should be leader. Yes. Fight him at bridge. Fighting for human.
Hey, Doc. How you like your new home? Why am I here? Why are there humans in cages? Oh, those guys, yeah. They got sick. I won't help you. <laughs> Go to hell. Hell? <laughs> well, I think you're already there. Come on. Alive. But there were apes hiding, waiting to trap us, kill us. I did not know about apes hiding. Maybe you not know. Soldiers took me prisoner. They want to take over the town. Then take over your tribe. Oh, oh. I do not understand. Apes and humans, both in cages. If you let me out, we could warn Jess. Many soldiers. Many guns. Trust Jess. Our town wants peace. Jess did not betray you. Free me and we can warn her. These soldiers are heading out soon. I've heard them. Let me out. Together, we can beat them. But we have to act fast. This is not gonna end well. Rainy! We've got to get out of here. Well, that's not gonna be too damn easy. <clears throat> Let me know when you cracked it. Men grabbed me on the bridge, took me away. Well, it's in Reeves. They're not just ape hunters. They've got a trainload of soldiers heading this way, aiming to take over the town tomorrow. Bryn freed me. This doesn't make any sense. What I saw apes in cages, humans too. Guns, explosives, they're gonna take over here, then go slaughter the apes. We've gotta do something. Do something? Take a look around, there's not many options. What 
are you doing, Willits? Okay. Since you asked. You see, <clears throat> you think you can rebuild this country with a bunch of survivalists? Like you? Rainy? <laughs> nice townspeople? No goddamn way. Needs planning. Strong leaders. Hell, one leader. Think that's you, Willits? Go to hell. Just doing what has to be done. I think your people see that. It's that good old Rainy here, I guess. They think you're ready to work with us? Against these damn dirty apes? Because I know that there's a little boy in the infirmary that would just love to see his mom. He's gonna be fine, by the way. What about the town? Your people staying, how does that work? We take care of the apes. Every last one of them. Then we can see about everything else. It's about getting things back to normal. Enough bullshit, Willits. You still don't get it, do you? I'll come check on you later. Yeah, maybe not. Rainy, what's coming? We can't fight alone. It's either give it up now, give Willits to town, or... Jess. I don't know. You two think this is a shot we gotta take? Yeah. Then we fight together. I know just this spot. The old coal tower in the valley sits over the rails. Back in the day, trains always had to slow. No better place for an ambush. You bring as many apes as you can, and we stop that train before it even gets near the town. <coughs> so let's make a plan. We blow up those tracks just as that train hits the tower. But Jess, when this is all over, we need to talk about who's gonna run this town. Still, it's gonna be a long shot, but it's the only shot we got. Yeah, it could work. We got a lot of C4 in the armory. I get all my people, whoever the hell's left. I'm gonna get Mark. He comes with us. Not nah, best I do that. My men are there. I go, there's no questions. You, Maria, get the explosives. C4. Wire. Okay. You good? Good. Oh, hey, Doc. I didn't expect to see you here. Put the gun down. I said put the gun down! And the other one.
What's in the bag, Miss Ross? <laughs> I said, what's in the bag, Miss Ross? C4. What do you plan on doing with C4? Listen, nobody has to get hurt. I think it's a bit late for that now, huh? I'm gonna put the bag down. Okay. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. a girl. Sure you're up to this? Yeah. All thought out. <laughs> Let's move, Mark. Yeah. Look. You have seen many soldiers come, many guns. It is war. We will not fight alone. Humans will fight with us against the soldiers.
Hurry up! Put it right here. It's perfect. Those the apes? Better be. If they're not, we're in big trouble. Take cover now! Must have gone for more men. We gotta blow the tracks now. You gonna be okay? I live. You gotta do it now. Go. Here. Yeah. I'll get back to Rainy. Okay. All armed. I gotta say I admire the ambition. <laughs> but this is as far as you're gonna get. Just put it down. You're not gonna get away with this. Oh, I don't know, Willits. Even with a damn army, you still screw up. Drop it!
we go home. Jess! How are you doing? Good. Keeping busy. Good for you. How are you doing? Compared to what? 